guys i'm super excited in this special video i'm going to show you guys how to lift money you have on your paper hood into your available balance i'll show you guys with this quick trick that you can use to get money on your available balance into your paper hood so let's dive right into it So this is my PayPal account. If you don't know how to create a PayPal account, I've already covered it on my channel how to do so. You can watch my channel videos and create your account like this where you can receive payments no matter where you are. If you are in Nigeria, if you are in South Africa, if you are in Ghana, it doesn't matter. You can create a successful PayPal account that sends and withdraws money and you can also receive payment. Real quick, you can see from my balance, there's zero available balance here. But if you come on the whole balance, you can see you have... 77.72 pounds on hold so this is what i have on hold and it's coming from a payment i received so if you want to get your phone sooner just come here and see what's on hold click on see what's on hold you can click here on this button or you can click on the payment recent activity the payment that you received uh, the money from so there are two ways to get into the same platform so i'll use this see what's on hold click on it right once it loads up as you can see so see the transaction is coming on this available on may so they will release this automatically on 17th may but i don't have time to wait for that long i will show you guys how to get your funds instantly right so if you want to get your funds instantly you can see the transaction details you can refund so what you have to do is to click on get your money sooner click on get your money sooner now they ask you two questions is it a product or is it a service or virtual product kindly select a service or virtual product then click on confirm order status mm -hmm. while you are selecting service or virtual product is like service is like virtual products like software that is sent to the buyer or like uh let me see let me see fl studio for instance uh, the software someone bought it from you and you sent it to them via email Whereas products has to do with a physical product like your TV set, which requires shipping by FedEx or UPS or DHL, as the case may be. So that one normally takes a lot of time. So choose service or virtual product and click on confirm order status. Once you click on it, this is the interface you are going to see. So order status, they have three options here: completed, in process, cancelled. Kindly leave it as completed. Now you have completed the order status. Here on service completion date, today's date is April, so check the date date is April 26th. Now here is the interesting part. Under the calendar, don't put a don't put a back or feature date rather. Don't put a feature date rather. If you put a feature date, they will cancel the whole transaction. Either you put the current date, which is 26th, or you put a back date, right? As for me, I'll use a back date that I've already fulfilled the order. If you put a future date, it means you are yet to fulfill the order, so you won't get your money sooner. So today is 26th, that's of the day I'm recording this video. So I'm putting 25th as a back date. That means I've already fulfilled this order on the 25th of April. That means completed. So after that, click on submit. Now, as you can see, you have successfully updated your order information, and you might say to your customer with the information you provided. So they will send the buyer an information that they have received the product and all that. So if I come back to the transaction page, instead of seeing 17th May, they will reduce the time the funds will be available for me. So let me go to the activity page. Alright, so you can see that the get your money sooner tab is no more available here. Instead, what is available is add your tracking information. Now, I want to encourage you to add your tracking information. Tracking information means like the UPS uh, number, the tracking number, and shipped by, let me say, you shipped it by FedEx. So, you put the tracking information now. Why you shouldn't do so is that paper can track this tracking number that you added using FedEx, and if they don't see the product or service that you rendered, they will mark the transaction bad so don't add anything here don't add any tracking information even if you want to add tracking information what you just do is let me go back there what you just do is mark it as sent right so let me click on track add tracking information so what you do other status leave it as sent don't leave it at in process hold cancel return or other process just leave it as sent and come here on the checkbox and click this tracking information not required and click on submit if you want to add your tracking information 
but for the purpose of this tutorial i'm not going to add it right so don't add all this information they can track it and if they don't see the product or service they'll cancel your transaction so this is the interface here so what you do next once you arrive here after uh, completing get your phone sooner is to contact the sender contact the sender and tell them to go to the activity page just like this instead of seeing ad tracking information they will see get confirm receipt that means confirm that they have received the service or products that you render to them so they'll see a button like this a blue button written confirm receipt they will just click on the button confirm receipt and they will say the order have been confirmed as soon as they click that this font this font here this 77 pounds will be available instantly for me under my available balance if i come to the home page it will move from the hold balance to this available balance instantly once they click on confirm receipt so after recording this video i'll call the sender of these phones and tell them to click on confirm receipt so i'll have the phones available so that's how to instantly get your phones available for you on paypal successfully i hope this video was helpful now if you want to withdraw your paypal phones i offer the service of withdrawing your paypal phones i can do that for you guys and also if you want to fund your paypal phones you want to fold your paypal account rather i can fund your paypal account for you and check all the services i render I can fund your screen, net teller, I can buy gift cards, sell gift cards. I do a lot of services along the banner passing below the screen. Check out the services I render and contact me whichever service you deem fit for me to uh, render for you. Now, my contact information is the first thing below in the description box. My Instagram, my WhatsApp, my Facebook, my email. You can call me as well so you can transact. So, my contact information is the first thing below in the description box. And that being said, guys i'll see you guys on my next video